Hey guys, Sam Mac here. Um, so, Dissidia for uh, Dissidia Final Fantasy just came out for uh, iOS and Android, and I thought I'd do a quick reroll tutorial. Um, so, I just killed the first Iron Giant in the tutorial. Um, so, that's when you unlock, you get 5,000 gems uh, that from, from the pre registration campaign that everyone gets. You don't have to pre register yourself. Uh, so we're going to jump in, and that's when you unlock summoning. So we're going to summon. You'll see there's two banners, there's two options. Uh, there's this 5,000, 10 plus 1 um, weekly draw. And then there's also uh, this half price release celebration banner. Uh, so for 2,500, you can get another 10 plus 1. And both have a 5-star guarantee. Um, this first one has a higher chance for uh, Cloud, Warrior Light, and Barks' weapons, but... Uh, I think we're just going to roll on, on the Southern Melts Rail first, so um, let's just do that right away. I'm going to show you how to reset your account afterwards, and then we'll, uh, we'll do another reroll. So, all right, so getting some three stars, some armor, some weapons, a lot of ninja stars and stuff coming through here, throwing weapons, fists, a robe. Where's the five star? Uh, there's our first four star, another four star, and our five star is. I don't know what this is. Is it's Vivi's. Okay, so I don't think Vivi is a very sought after character, unfortunately. Um, but the good news is, this is a reroll tutorial, so this is what we're going to reroll. So, uh, yeah, so obviously not a great roll. Um, only got one five star and it was VV. So what we're going to do is we're going to go into, uh, some kind of file explorer. Uh, you have to do like this. So that might just jump around a lot for you guys. Sorry about that. Um, so we're going to go into emulated Android data and then we're going to look for com.squareenix. Right here, and we're gonna rename this folder, and uh, so I'm just gonna put like a one on the, on the end of it. Real quick here, hit go, and then what'll happen is I should close the app as well. Close all the other apps. All right. Um, then what'll happen is we're gonna go to settings. apps and then again we're going to find Dissidia pretty sure it's under Dissidia here probably not um, it is under Opera Omnia uh, so we're going to storage you'll see it's showing it only having uh, 73 megabytes that's because we renamed that folder so we're going to clear data it's going to clear it everything Wait for that to update. Okay, it hasn't updated yet. So we have to wait. Um, so we can come back. Clear data. Okay, there we go. I'm not sure why that took up so long. Usually it doesn't take that long. And then so we're going to go in here. We're going to uh, rename this again back to what it was. And then you'll notice if we come back here, this data just jumped back up to uh, 328 megabytes. And so what that means is we won't have to re-download the, the data when we play the game again. So I'm going to relaunch the game. And it'll be like we never played it. I'm just going to connect everything again. Okay, we're going to go new game. We're going to agree to these. And this is all stuff you should have seen um, by now. Basically, we're going to run through the tutorial again and then summon again. Um, if the main thing you want to know is how to reset uh, the game without 
uh, having to reload the data that the video is basically over for you. But if you want to hang on here and watch me watch my reroll, then uh, that's cool too. Okay, it does say it's downloading again, which surprises me because this stuff should already be download downloaded. I wonder what happened there. Just want to check something. So I'm in New Zealand right now, and my connection isn't great. So hopefully, we don't have to download again. If you do. Uh, Okay, here we go. So yeah, it's just it's just checking the files. So that's sweet. Um, so oh, maybe we can't skip this. Hmm. That's funny. So it looks like you can't skip the video even if you already have the files downloaded. That's going to slow down rerolls for sure. Curious if there's a way around that. I'm gonna have to look into that. But uh, for now, if I hit back, what happens? Nothing. Else. Okay. I guess we'll have to just look at this again. It's not too long. While this is going, let's look at this tier list that. Uh, we're using off Reddit. Um, so thanks to um, Eureka for, for making this. Um, so on the, they had two different strategies. The first strategy is looking for characters who are very strong at the start. Um, and for that, you're looking for Van or Cloud. And uh, Ishtola and Warrior Light and Cecil are all also very good. So those are kind of the top five. Um, you guys also are quite good, and then uh, there's a few people who are really bad, so um, I won't even really get into that. And then uh, the other kind of thing they recommend is going for future proof units. So uh, the future proof units are Van, Terra, Cloud again, Barts, Yuna, Warrior Light, Cecil, and then to a lesser extent, Fury and Nistola. I guess there's also some other people who have their level cap and are, are uh, raised and are pretty good. But um, these are the main ones that they're pointing out. So, uh, so again, like kind of combined, like Van and Cloud are very good. Uh, Zuna with the units in the top list as well. Warrior Light uh, and I think Cecil as well. So um, really these top five are kind of good at the start. And also, uh, or top six, I guess, um, also future proof. So we're definitely looking for maybe two of, two of the top six here. Uh, I'm not super sure how tough that'll be with a single 10 plus one rule, but we're going to try. Actually, I think you get Warrior Blight automatically. Um, I think you get Warrior Lights five star sword automatically through the uh, through the tutorial so really we're looking for two out of the remaining five um, and this video should be almost done it's not though let's see uh See if anyone has a way to skip this video. Alright, here we go. So we're done. So you can name your account there, you can change it later, so it's not a big deal. Uh, we're back in the tutorial. I'm gonna skip. I'm just gonna fly through this. Like if you guys want to read everything while you're playing, feel free to. Um, and yeah, this is just telling us that we get 10,000 gems at the end of the tutorial. And 
Let's open up that list again. So it's Mandy. And then we're going to go through some fights. The tutorial is pretty good. It teaches you how it works. Um, obviously, I'll talk through the combat as you do it. But basically, you're um, using brave attacks to steal um, attack from attack power from your enemies. And then you can do it till they hit zero and then they break and they def uh, you get an extra boost to your attack. So we'll start with the brave attack. And then it's going to mix on after attack again. So that's just like kind of a normal attack. You have to basically brave attack before you normal attack, otherwise you do zero damage. Uh, but you'll see the, the monster's uh, broken now, so when you hit him, that would do quite a bit more damage. Um, it lets us attack freely after this, so instead of doing brave attack, brave HP, brave HP, I'm just going to brave twice. So we broke him, and then we're going to attack. And we'll get we'll one shot at that time. Um, then again, uh, multiple enemies is telling you. Oh, we get we get everybody now, uh, and you can tap into the target. So we're gonna switch to the guy with the lower brave to start, so we can break him right away. And then everyone gets a break bonus once he gets broken. And uh, I'm actually, break the other guy. You know, since I can't one shot him with PV. And then I will one shot it. Her and one shot for the guy. So I think that's the quickest you can do that fight. I could be wrong, but at most I'm off by one attack. So I'm level up, get some skills. So you got a fire attack, which is a, a brave attack, not an HP attack. And uh, we got a cure on Ren. And we got a shield on uh, Warrior Light. And we got lots of clear bonuses. Telling us about the missions you can do. So you see, we got all three missions last time. They're pretty easy as long as we gain reasonably efficient on these first ones. It's just more about finishing the set amount of turns. Alright, so brave attack. And then I'll finish them off. I'm not gonna lie, I wasn't really paying attention and I'm not sure what uh, what triggers that chain there. I'm gonna find out more about that. Because the chaining seems really powerful. So it's cool you can actually see how much damage you're gonna do. So on the blinking, you'll see the missing HP. So I know I can't kill him, so I'm gonna go and just brave attack the next guy. Um, and then wait for people who actually have their brave charged up to uh, to be able to one shot him. So yeah, Ren can one shot him now. Uh, we'll brave him again with BB to to break him. And BB can get one shot him there. And so the frame rate's pretty bad. Uh, again, I'm on my laptop traveling right now, so. Things aren't ideal. I didn't even realize the game was going to be out while I was going to be gone, but that's how it goes. And I wanted to get a video out, so it's the best I can do right now. I hope it's okay and still helpful to people. All right, so I think we have two more quests, and then we'll be able to uh, do our summary again. So yeah, she's telling me about enemy weaknesses. And we'll start. So you're just saying this plan is uh, we did the spire, so uh, we're gonna do that today. And yeah, I think we'll just attack with the other thing. We'll go on. Okay, so I haven't noticed yet, so I know there's another battle here. Do we keep the brave we had in the previous round? No, we don't. Okay, we don't. 
So there's no point of like saving it for a leaf. Should be able to one shot each one of these guys now. Who'd be doing work? Alright, so I think we fight the iron guy now. Pretty sure. Yeah, see. So I think I read something, um, I didn't try it last time, but uh, after you beat the Iron Giant, I think you can close the app and open it again, and you can kind of skip the tutorial that normally tells you about how to like level up here. Uh, Alright, so you can tell you the Shine Shield on. The, the, I don't know how important that is, but let's, let's do it just there. Broken again. So I've seen you in much damage. I think it's like almost like we're breaking them so fast that we're not uh, getting our, our own uh, break that high. Oh, here we go. Oh, we hit him up, but we didn't get to uh, juggle him that time. Alright, here we go. Again. All right, so we some kill barn John, and hopefully we have uh, better luck on uh, on our roll this time. So we get that tutorial draw ticket, which I'm pretty confident gives us a four year light five star automatic. That's what happened my first time through at least. Maybe I just got very lucky and didn't realize. Alright, so we go to the summon, we do a single ticket. Oh, we got Vivi that time. So huh, I guess you don't always get warrior light. I think you have the, hmm, I didn't see it, but it looked like you had the option of VV, Warrior Light, or Ram. So there's the tutorial characters, tutorial characters. So you definitely want one where you get Warrior Light on that first pull. Uh, all right, so I'm going to try the thing. Hopefully this works, otherwise, otherwise it's going to be a waste of time. So if you quit there, I think you might be able to skip a little rest of the tutorial here and go straight back into um, to be able to sound it. Let's see. Hopefully. We're in there. Sweet K. Yeah, we're in all rewards. Um, and there's tons of news that comes up. No, that news. All right, so we can go. Oh, we can go back to. Uh, now we still have to do it. All right. Just, hmm. Someone told me that was a thing, but I guess not, guys. At least I've uh, confirmed that it is not a thing. Let's be honest, this doesn't take that long. But still. Would have been nice to skip if we go to. Really just shows you how to, uh, 
how to enhance your gear and then equip it. So gear gives you passive abilities. Um, all right, so we're back here. Oh yeah, we need to accept our gifts. And so again, we're gonna go back and we're gonna do that half price draw. I think that's the better one to do. And hopefully we get a good five star this time or even multiple five stars would be great. Okay, dagger. Oh, I clicked right through a little too fast. And let's see, we got hope. So that sucks. Um, yeah, so that's how you reroll though. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna reroll again because I got BB and hope, which are could be low on the tier list. Um, and hope I got better luck next time. Uh, hopefully, that was useful to you guys. Uh, and. Best of luck with your rerolls. Hope you enjoyed the game. Uh, I know I'm going to be playing a lot over the next couple, couple days, and uh, I probably won't do any videos, and more videos, until I'm back, um, back at home, which is in I don't know, two or three weeks. But uh, I do think I'll I'll be playing, and I'll probably be doing some more videos on this game. So uh, best of luck again, and uh, yeah, have a good week, guys. Thanks for watching. Cheers.